Mmm. Hello, beta testers. To quickly and effortlessly summarize a developer ask me anything, here are the questions and answers. In response to the question, can we get units for duplicates? The answer is no. Mmm. Okay. How do you like that? In response to the question, can we expect to see our units back? The answer is, we plan to reimburse you, which is a fancy way of saying, no, you're going to get something, but it's not going to be the exact amount of units that you lost. Which is amazing because after they patched in shipments and stole the units that you finally had something to spend them on, they then nerfed a farm that they knew you were using to get units. Yo, they pay attention, they move quickly, but only when it comes to making that money and hopefully keeping you playing longer, which is cruel because half of these motherfuckers gonna stay on this hamster wheel no matter how hard they pop them in the mouth, it's clear. To the question, can we expect to see villains in the future, maybe Crossbones, Modoc? <laughs> this question was flat out ignored. Get booked. Another question makes it clear. The big black balls are still in our face. We know this is what you like, Crystal Dynamics, but for the rest of us, can we expect a fix? And they said, we'll pass on the information. Bitch. To somebody else asking, hey, can we have replayable mega hives? Can we have a bit of variety in the things that you can do for high level gear? You know, especially since the one OLT and the one raid in this over a year old live service are bugged so hard that your game can crash just matchmaking for it. Crystal Dynamics said, eh, maybe, and no. Why can't Spidey web up bosses? Someone asked. It's working as intended. Why don't you try using cryo, you dweeb? Someone else asks, why don't stats reliably and consistently increase when upgrading pieces of gear? To which, of course, they respond, it's a bug. We're aware we're investigating and soon. In the meantime, shill for our skins and market our game, you fucking baboon. This shit was okay a year ago. Why is it a problem now? Why don't you hobble down to the shop and buy some skins, you stupid clown? Is it a little bit shady, a little bit scummy? Spaghetti on your shirt and your nose is runny. Crystal game broke and they find it funny. All of Batilla Stutter cost them money. Damn, Crystal Dynamics. Your game's running like this and you talking to people like that? Y'all like the Kellogg's of game studios. Tapical. Did y'all see it takes to win game of the year at the game awards? They deserve it too. Refreshing, innovative, a fun shared experience, and most of all, it's functional, which seems to be a real rare thing these days. Whenever I needed to laugh Marvel's Avengers, you were there. So honestly, I have to thank you. But sometimes, I laughed so hard I couldn't stop. I realized I was holding a knife, a bloody knife, and it wasn't my blood. <laughs> Like this video if you're okay with me telling a joke or two before I gotta go put some water in a shill mama bowl, you know what I'm talking about? Remember when they said a roadmap was coming out by the end of the year? Pepperidge Farm remembers. But that was a joke from Crystal Dynamics. Shout out to all the haters who for some reason can't stop watching me and leaving that one comment in the comment section. What I can't understand is if you don't like the game, why do you play it? <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to those of you who have few escapes from reality and a limited amount of time to enjoy them. I know you want something to take the edge off occasionally before restraining yourself and enduring the monotonous everyday grind that is work, social interaction, and somehow tolerating people's ignorance. I'm right there with you. Our lives aren't so luxurious that we can expect to do a bad job and then somehow keep it. But forgive me if I'm not being as funny as Crystal Dynamics. Allow me to tell you a poop tier joke about as inspired as their wannabe comic book skins. If Marvel's Avengers was a bowel movement, it wouldn't just be diarrhea. It'd be the type where you like gotta fully take off all of your clothes and just like, you know you jumping straight in the shower after this. You know what I mean? Marvel's Avengers may not be winning awards for anything but biggest piece of crap, but it did impact all of us. Gentian impact us. It educated us. It taught us to see through the pathetic attempts of fragile, insecure, fucking dweebs. You really came out into a game for comic book nerds and made us feel like jocks. My God. It's like the new Saints Row over in that studio. <laughs> I'm so sorry. This whole video has been like riffing up until this point. You know what else is funny? Recycled Red Room content. Please clap. Here at Crystal Dynamics, we know you love recycled content. So the Red Room is back. And in the interest of preserving the 
accuracy of the first and second experiences when they were initially implemented, all the bugs you know and loved are back, baby! This is a Pikachu face. It's the reaction of every late chill who is suddenly experiencing bugs in Marvel's Avengers, and now that it's happening to them, it's a big deal. And let me tell you something, beta tester, I will not stand for this hate. These personal attacks against my brand, my brand, the shills I know would do and say anything for that ad revenue, no matter what. And when Crystal Dynamics says, lick, lick, lick my balls, they're already salivating and they can use their tears for their holes. No lube necessary, they're good to go. That's what being a true defender is all about, and I will not watch this slander against my beloved company continue to unfold, because if it does, I will become a moderator of the Play Avengers subreddit myself, and delete all of your criticisms and problems and hate, because the only posts that need to be here are photo mode posts and skin requests. You're welcome, and I'm helping the community, and I represent the community. <laughs> This non-consensual beta tester thing has made a couple of us historians. Beta testers, I love you. We paid for this game, and you damn sure we gonna get that laugh out of it. Thank you for liking, commenting, supporting, and advocating for a future that is less Marvel's Avengers and more anything, anything other than that. I don't need to talk about the superior Unreal Engine 5. I don't need to talk about the traversal and the upcoming DC game, you know. And you're gonna be seeing a lot of it. Tell me what you think happens next, because I know that when this game goes free to play, if you thought the game was stingy before, you are gonna see exactly why they're flinching right now at people earning credits too fast. I know two very fast credit farms right now that I know the shills wouldn't have been able to resist the views to put out if they know it. And I'ma hold on to them, see if Crystal Dynamics patches it by the time that they roll out their next phase which again will allow unit purchase with real money, which they'll try to justify with some spicy like, oh, we got an actual comic book skin now. And the hypocrites that have nothing but trash to talk on Genshin, Future Evolution, whatever other more successful game than this one, and say shit like, you have to support and acknowledge them when they do something right, as if they haven't spent a year talking down to, ganging up on, and attempting to silence people who have been justifiably upset, experiencing the types of bugs that they're pretending cropped up overnight. Remember I can see the deleted Reddit comments, so just like I said in my tweet, even with the critical questions deleted, they limbo clean under bedrock level expectations. I don't know how they do it, but you're gonna hate me for saying it. When it comes to Crystal Dynamics, it gets worse. Forgive the light editing, I have some other projects to finish recording. I love you to death and go try out that web shooting in Spider-Man. If the servers don't stay exploded because motherfuckers actually play that game, I will see y'all later. Start. I will see y'all later. Uh. Uh. No! We're all dead! We're all fucking dead, bro! This guy fucking kills us all, man! Please help us! We're the sea! We're stranded! Shy Guy's a murderer! <laughs> he wants to shy about murder. Nope. It's The Rock. Hey, did he smell what he was cooking? <laughs> Ow! It's about drive. What?